Okay, so this is another app uh, by Dr. Gary Brown and uh, Discrete Trial Training, and this one is DTT Numbers. Um, and I'll just read to you what it says on the screen here. This app uses discrete trial training to help your child learn the numbers 0 to 99 and to learn to count. DTT is not a children's game. It is a therapy based on years of scientific research. DTT is the primary teaching method used in Applied Behavior Analysis, ABA, to teach numerous pre-academic and social skills to children with autism. The app can be used to help teach numbers and counting to children with autism, attention deficit disorder, or attention deficit hyperactive disorder. The apps, can, the apps also can be used by any child who has trouble staying on task. So with that said, let's um, go ahead and have a look. He provides uh, instruction, which is uh, obviously very, very important when uh, uh, you're using an app like this. So that's on there for you. Uh, we'll go through the video. These are the, the other apps, and we've reviewed all of these already on the site, uh, the colors, the shapes, and the letters. Um, and this is a little bit about uh, Dr. Gary Brown. So um, let's go back and start. So what we get is you get to enter your student's name at the top, um, which I've put in there. And then uh, as you go through this, you'll see on the left-hand side you have the, the number the child is trying to learn and you have from 0 to 9 and if you do that you can also learn the numbers by bear counting and that goes up to number 9. Anything above that will just be regular numbers so you would highlight for example the numbers you want to learn. We'll take these off so I can show you. Uh, let's say we want to learn the number 4 today and then you would on this side you would highlight the incorrect numbers um, so we can make it as simple as just having one number which uh, uh, Dr. Brown recommends you start at um, or you can have as many numbers as you like so you could have the child trying to learn the number four and then have the numbers three five six eight and seven on the screen at the same time and see if they can uh, find the number four um, so what we'll do is we're trying to learn number four so we'll highlight on this side the incorrect numbers are number two number six and number eight um, you can change the amount of cards on the bottom here from 10 down to 2. What we'll do is we'll leave that at 6 cards. Interval uh, in between questions we've got at 5 seconds. Uh, again you can lower this, you can bring it all the way up to a minute and a half depending on the child's um, uh, capabilities. We'll leave that at 2 seconds purely only for this demonstration um, because of time and then maximum time trial is they get 60 seconds to answer the question okay and again you can change this down to uh, pretty immediate uh, we have the language pack here we have English built in which is what we're going to use for this demonstration um, card types at the top we have simple sans serif or the bear count um, let's go ahead and look at these. So if we go on practice numbers, you'll see what they look like. You can change the background from dark to light, whichever works best for you. You can also change the numbers that you want to learn. So as you scroll through this, uh, it goes all the way up to 99, which is very cool. Put it back on dark. Go back to the menu. And then if you... Uh, if you look at it on the um, the bear count, sorry, go back out here. Uh, on the bear count, you'll see that bears appear on the cards. So what we're going to do to start this is we'll use the bear count numbers. Um, now, as you go through this, it will keep a log. So when you view the log, the data will come up here of how well you're doing or how well you did um, throughout the uh, the process. So let's go ahead and start this so I can give you a a better view of what happens. Let's go and make this five. Look, make the background light. So we've got this on the bare numbers. So uh, we're trying to find the number five. And uh, like I said, we have a lot of other numbers that are uh, trying to throw us off. We have number four, the number six um, in there as well. So the idea is to find correct the number cool five. Beans. And as you continue, you'll see we've got one out of ten correct, and we're on number trial number two. Three. And we have to find three. Good job. Five. 
and five again. Now, if I go back out, let me just highlight uh, a wrong answer here. Oops. Try again. And we'll go back out to the menu and change the way that you see the numbers. I'm going to reduce the uh, time here. Uh, we'll reduce the cards down to five and the fade button. I'm going to show you what that is. So now what we're trying to do, uh, let's change this up. Let's change this up to, uh, we want to learn 30 to 39. And we don't want to learn the 40s, so we have a difference here. 30, 4. Okay, so we're trying to learn numbers in the 30s and not in the 40s. So again, you would right. highlight these. 30, 3. Good job. You are so smart. 39. Okay, and so on. And if you can't find a number, if the child needs help, you would press the fade 30, button. 39. And it would, it would highlight the number. See, if I 30, press this, it nine. jumps out. And then the child yes. would press that. And you would keep going through 30, that. 5. Good job. 31. Okay, and the reason right. these other these are numbers four and six are coming up is because I've still got them turned 30. on in the first screen um, for the correct and the incorrect answers. So that's why we're getting them yes. showing up. Uh, you would simply turn those off. Thirty six. But what I want to do is Long. I want to complete this Try trial again. so you can see how it works. Thirty seven. Correct. I knew you could do it. And we're on trial number nine 30. out of ten. Correct. I knew. You could do it. I think this is the last one. 31. Good job. You are so smart. Okay, so when you complete this, uh, you got 8 out of 10, which equals 80% with 1 prompted. Now, like I said, as you go through the process, you get the log that shows up here. So at 7.43 a.m. Uh, or p.m., um, whatever the time may be on this date, uh, Ben got 80%. Uh, against the numbers 4, 6, and 8, because that's what we originally had the settings on, um, and, and so on. So you can keep track of how you go through, uh, go through, the, um, through the program, and it will, uh, it'll keep that for you. And you can always reset it. You can, like I said, have it on a dark background or a light background. Uh, the incorrect or the correct numbers go all the way to 99. If you use 0 to 9, you can use the bear. Um, otherwise, you will just use the regular numbers. But um, this was a, another demonstration uh, of an app uh, that Dr. Gary Brown put together. And uh, you can see all the apps on the site, the letters, the shapes, and the colors.